when you work on any programming language you need a development environment to be set up on your machine in which you can write your code and execute your code when it comes to python anaconda is the most widely used tool which you can use for setting up python environment on your machine it comes with default python packages along with multiple development environments like spider as well as jupiter hi my name is rohit and in this video we are going to check how you can set up anaconda on your laptop let's get started to install and set up python on your laptop you can simply go to anaconda.com there you would get open source version of anaconda which you can set up on your laptop that would give you python along with all the dependencies that you need when you are working as a data analyst or data scientist after going on anaconda.com you would see options to download the installer so based on your os you can select the installer which you want to download so in this video i am going to cover steps for setting up anaconda on windows but the steps would more or less look same for mac as well as for linux os so simply click on download the installer that would download the installer or your laptop or desktop and after you have that .exe file just double click it so that the installation should start after that after double clicking the .exe file you would have to click on next then as for any software there is a license agreement which you would have to accept and agree before starting the installation process then select the type of installation so if you want to install just for you as a user or for all users on that particular machine you would have to select the option accordingly it's better to just keep it as default then choose the location on your machine where you want to get the installation done so you would get the suggested location automatically over here but if you want to install at some other location you can change it over here and then click on next please note that you would require around 5 gb of space for installing anaconda so please plan accordingly then it would also show you advanced installation options in terms of selecting or deselecting few things from here again there is no need to make anything complicated just go ahead and select all the options for setting up anaconda and then just click on install the installation process might take some time so you would have to wait for 10 to 15 minutes for the installation to complete once the installation is done you would see the window like this where you would get the finish button so just click on finish and that would complete your setup of anaconda to verify the installation just go to the search menu on your laptop and search for anaconda navigator and after you click on that you would see a window like this so this window would show various things that you got along with the installation of anaconda and python so you would see jupiter you would see spider jupiter lab everything over here then the next step is actually start doing something using jupiter or spider So if you want to use Jupyter just go to your search menu and type Jupyter notebook you would see a icon like this then just click on that icon and that would open a browser window where you would see various options So you would get a browser window where you would see various options just click on new python notebook and that should open a new python notebook for you in jupiter so this is how your jupiter notebook would look like you can start coding in this so maybe let's try to print something so i'm just typing the print statement and i am printing hello learners and uh, let's run it so this is the button you can use for learning then if you want to add additional code okay let's write 
प्रिंट एडिशनल कोड अगेन टू रन दिस पर्टिकुलर लाइन यू कैन यूज द रन बटन देन देर इज दिस ऑप्शन विच वुड हेल्प यू टू रिस्टार्ट द कर्नल एंड बेसिकली री रन होल नोटबुक सो यू डोंट हैव टू देन रन सेल बाय सेल और लाइन बाय लाइन सो इफ यू इफ यू क्लिक ऑन दिस it would just run everything again then if you want to create a new cell you can use a plus icon over here that would create a new cell on which you can write a code for saving the notebook you have option over here if you click on this that would save your current notebook or your current python code then using jupiter you can also add headers in your python notebook so suppose if i want to add here let's start learning and i want to change this to heading so it would automatically change the type of text to heading now let's go to the new cell and if you see here the new cell by default is code it's a python code so this is how you can use jupyter notebook when you start learning python i hope you are able to set up anaconda and python on your laptop using the steps in this video if you face any issues let me know in comments in the next video we would cover how you can use python variables and data types to start learning python so see you in the next video bye bye